I'm Jim Kunkemuller. I'd like to welcome you to this exciting website that offers free instructional videos on a number of appliance fabrication techniques. First, you'll see a demonstration of pressure forming that is essential to all the techniques. At any time, you can exit the demonstration and access the videos and other materials immediately. Thanks for your interest. Hello, my name is Bill Gertner with Great Lakes Orthodontics. This is the Ministar Positive Pressure Machine for Thermal Forming. It can form a wide variety of thermal plastics in thicknesses that range from a tenth of a millimeter up to five millimeters. Some of the appliances you can fabricate include splints, mouth guards, bleaching trays, holly retainers, and invisible retainers. The machine is actually accurate enough to make a matrix for duplicating models. We're often asked about the difference between the vacuum machine and the Ministar. The primary difference is the suction of a vacuum versus the positive pressure of the Ministar, which results in the best accuracy possible. The Ministar operates at 16 pounds of positive pressure. It's that coupled with the fact that the same side of the material that has been heated is the side of the material that comes in contact with the model. Those two things together equal better fit and detail to your dental cast. Any vacuum machine can only offer 14 pounds of polar suction from underneath the model. So that 14 pounds of suction has to go out around the model, grab the material and pull it down over the cast. Just not an efficient way to get good adaptation. Let me show you the kind of detail you can expect from the Ministar. This is a piece of our one millimeter soft mouth guard material that you might use for a bleaching tray. The material gets clamped into place. The heating times for all of the materials are located on each of the boxes. I'll enter the 30 seconds of recommended heating time. The heating element with the Mini Star will activate in one second and it reaches its work temperature in the amount of time it takes me to move it from back to front. As soon as the Mini Star begins to heat the material, the timer counts down in seconds. The Mini Star makes it very easy to teach somebody how to use the machine because the heating element is consistent from one machine to the next. So we can tell you exactly how long to heat each material. You know with the vacuum machine, you're never really sure when the material is heated properly, so you're relying on the droop and slump of that material, but you never really know when the time is right to form the material with a vacuum, resulting in inconsistency and rework. With five seconds remaining in the heating cycle, you'll hear a prompt. At the end of the heating cycle, you'll get a longer prompt, letting you know that the heating cycle is complete. I'll bring the heated material over the model, and activate the air pressure simply by swinging the handle from a 12 o'clock position to a 6 o'clock position. You'll notice that the same side of the material that was the hottest was the side that came in contact with the model. It's just the opposite with a vacuum machine. The air pressure is entered through the hinge on top of the material and is pushing it down over the model and will continue to push it down for the entire cooling phase, ensuring ideal adaptation. Remember with a vacuum machine, at the point where the heated plastic fills the holes on the platform, the suction has stopped. There's no additional adaptation beyond that point. That prompt has told us that the cooling phase is done. We're able to release the pressure from the chamber. That prompt has let us know that we can open the machine. Now the material is cool to the touch at this point. and you can see the result is a perfectly formed matrix over this model. You don't see any folds or creases in this material because we heated it for the appropriate amount of time. The benefit to you is accuracy. Whether it's a more accurate bleaching tray, matrix for temporary or invisible retainer, you'll have the most accurate appliance possible with the Mini Star. I mentioned earlier a wide variety of applications for the machine. These are some of the most popular. It's easy to see with a variety of appliances that you're able to fabricate on the Mini Star that you can get a quick payback and take control of your lab bill. Many doctors have told us they've recouped their investment in just a few months. Thank you for watching this demonstration. At the end of the video, you'll have the option to watch technique videos, download fabrication techniques, access more information, speak with a customer service representative, or schedule a live one-on-one -on -one online demonstration.